Anthony Parker, and welcome back to Bad Witch Books. Today we're going to be going over my December TBR. Can you believe it's December already? God damn, it is about to be December. Where the freak did this year go? And you know what, I'm also, can we just say congrats to ourselves because I, I mean to me, but to ourselves through the channel, have been posting regularly since June. So June, July, August, September, November, December. Six months I've been posting regularly. I'm so happy I've been able to keep up with it, especially with my busy as hell work week that's been killing me. <sighs> yeah. But um yes, today we're gonna be going over my December TBR. So this TBR is going to be different from my last couple of TBRs because I will not be playing my TBR game because I wanna throw in every other every couple months a themed TBR. So this TBR will very much have a theme and this D themed D TBR is going to be sequels, series finishers, and continuations. So it's a December to the sequel, Electric Boogaloo, whatever you want to call it. Um, but yeah, so my goal this month is because I've got quite a lot of sequels, book twos, book threes, book fours, just books and series. And that I want to wrap up. I think most of them are actually just sequels. I keep saying like book two, three, four. I don't think I actually have any. That I have one book three, but the rest are book twos. But yeah, let's get into it. So the first book I plan to read in December is going to be well, not the first book. The first book I'm saying because I will read this in whatever order I decide fit. But yeah, is all the tides of fate, which is by Adeline Grace. This is the sequel to. All of the Stars and Teeth, which is about a princess who has, like, spirit magic, is basically dethroned because she fails this test, and it's her trying to, like, redeem herself so she can be the queen of the islands. I enjoyed the first one. I gave it three stars, and the second cover is really pretty, and it's, like, piratey, and I love me some pirates, and I've had this on my bookshelf for a while, so it's time I finish it so I can get it off my TBR cart, which is the main reason I'm doing this challenge. But yes. So the next book is Bones Crier Dawn, which is the sequel to Bones Cider's Moon, which is about this girl who she is a, she is basically a Grim Reaper almost, like her, her, her sisters and her sisters and her people, they are able, they take the dead into the afterlife, basically. And she has to, like, to do her full initiation to become one, she has to meet her true love and kill him, basically, in this right for their goddess. And, um, things go wrong, because one of the true loves is the main character who's actually been trying to hunt her kind, because one of his, her kind killed his father. And this is book two, where things have gone wrong. I'm excited to read it. The first one was all right. I enjoyed this cover. It's beautiful. Again, I'm excited to read it. The next book is my, I think, one of my most anticipated of this list, um, Kingdom of the Cursed, which is a sequel to Kingdom of the Wicked. This is about Amelia. She is trying to find out who killed her sister in book one. And in book two, she is now going to the underworld to meet the princes of hell that she's already met. But, like, see the prince, uh, the, like, the ruler, the high prince of hell, basically. And I know it's, I've heard this one's supposed to be very steamy. The first one was also quite steamy. Excited to read it. Um, I really enjoyed Kingdom of the Wicked. I really enjoyed her other series, Stalking Jack the Ripper. And so I'm excited to get to hell, basically. So the next book is Redemptor by um, Jordan Fuego. This is the sequel to Ray Bearer. And Ray Bearer was so good. So good. It is about this girl who she is tasked with killing the prince. And the only way to kill the prince is to become part of his chosen. And it's like once she gets to the chosen, she doesn't want to kill the prince. And it's just very like court drama, family stuff in this like amazing world. So I'm excited to read the sequel. I love this color, this cover, because I love the blues and purples. It's really pretty. And I think the like without the dress jacket is just as pretty. I was right. Without the dust jacket is just as pretty. And then I read a, uh, a Ray Bearer in December last year. So I'm liking that I'm reading Redemptor in December too. So that we're like, you know, keeping it up. Next book I re am reading is Palms of Storms and Silence by Rosanna Brown. This is the sequel to A Song of Wraith and Ruin. I loved A Song of Wraith and Ruin. A Song of Wraith and Ruin is about a girl who, when her... Her mom dies, the queen, 
of the kingdom. She has to take the place, but she doesn't want to take the place. And she has to, like, she gets this challenge. Because to find, well, basically rewind that. Because she doesn't want to take her mom's place. So she tries to bring her mom back to life. And so she does this whole challenge that whoever wins this challenge has to become king. Because she needs the heart of a king to, like, bring her mom back to life for this ritual. And then the other main character is the guy, I mean, the guy who wants to compete in the challenge. Because his sister is taken. And if he can get his, kill the princess. Or, yeah, the princess. He can get his sister back. So they're both, like, trying to kill each other. But they don't know it. Very good. Love the first book. Excited to finish off. Because I think this is just a duology. Now, the next book I do not own. It is The Damned. If I had any talent, it'd be in my hand right here. But I don't think it is going to be. Because I do not have talent on that. But it is the uh, third book in the uh, beautiful trilogy. I think it's more than a trilogy, but it's the third book in the beautiful ooh, series. And I am very excited for it. I love the beautiful. The Damned was amazing. Really excited for The Righteous is the book title. I know this. But yeah, The Righteous is the book title for it. And I know that Princess is doing a read-along. She, they're she, they're rereading book one and book two. And I wish I could, but I have my TBR thing I, was, I had already planned out. But when I heard about it... But I will be reading um, The Righteous with them. I'm very excited to. That'll probably, that comes out on the 7th. And I've already pre-ordered it. I don't really pre-order books. But I did pre-order this one. I love it. It's about vampires in New Orleans. And this is following, I believe, our main character's best friend. Because each book follows a different character. But yeah. Um, what have you guys... That's it, basically. This is a quick video. Because I didn't do my TBR game. But, um... What is it? Not what is it. What are you guys planning to read? Also, give me some other themes I could do for coming up months. Because I, I do want to do, like, maybe three every third, like, month. We'll do um, a TBR themed video. Like, this is, like I said, this is sequels. Continuers. But, yeah. So, give me some theme ideas if you guys have any. Um, I will see you guys next time. Like I said, what are you guys planning to read for December? Can you believe it's already December again? Where did this year go? Pretty soon it's going to be 2025. Like, I swear. But I will see you guys next time. Um, subscribe if you haven't subscribed to me yet. I don't know why you haven't. But I will see you guys next time.